All right, guys, I'll show you a quick job I'm doing today. I'm going to cut all the bamboo, all the brush back on that edge. Can I do a bit of a comp on here for my friend? Well, he just like, rents this area, but yeah, off us. So I said I'll make it a bit more secure for him. He do need to keep stuff here. Um, anyway, I want to get these panel fence in tight there. You see how much I got to cut back. So I thought I'd bring you for a ride with me to show what I do. And I cut off all these um, branches as well. I'll load these branches that are uh, overhanging over here. So I will cut back first, all with the pole saw, no edge cutter. Small pole saw first, clear it all the way. Uh, and we'll work our way up then with the long one. So we do I know, I'll set this camera up and uh, go from there. Right, you can see how much I've got to cut back. I'm going to go a fair way into it. So, get on in now. Thicker branches there, as you can see. So we're knocked through them. We've got to wash that barbed wire behind there. I think we can move it, but I can get through there. It was so effortless with this, cutting back. Brilliant. People just use power saws for doing working trees. Well, that's silly. Edge stuff, brilliant. Really good. Not safe for using chainsaw as well.
It'll take a fair bit of work, but it's getting there. You can see I'm getting a better line there. And what I do, I put a, a pile on the floor in like I done in the last video. And then chump it all, keep keep chopping it in. I'll show you what now. I'll cut through there. Clear all that away behind there. Um, I think we'll take some of these off now, these eye ones. Well, I'm here. I've got a pole saw in the van. Long reach. And uh, do it all on the floor and in one pile. Well, that's better already. That's how much room we'll have then. Bloody was right out there. Yeah. Lost a little now. Bloody five, six foot, like lost of space. Go right back as tight as I can with the fence. Bits off, yeah. Should check up in the tree first. In case you've got any stuff hanging about. Fall out on hill. That's quite neat, that is, eh? Take that one off here, then. Take this one off, yeah. The chain is catching. Quite neat that is, I'm happy with that. I could take another one off that side. Um, I'll come back to that. 
I'll just take these obvious ones by you now. Work our way through there. Clear it all up here. And uh, I'll be ready for a minute then. we are guys, I'll leave it there now, I'll do all the clean up and uh, chop it down in small chunks over there, or might even just throw it over onto that bash, fill it up and work it out later then, just want to get that fence across there, um, one of my yard vlogs then, I'll come back to this and show you when the fence, is, when the, the compound's all done like, but that's what I use, pole saw and obviously the long reach uh, pole saw telescope again. For the eye branches. I will take that off. Um, that one. There we are, guys. Some sort of compound for a minute. I will go another panel that way once that trailer's moved, so we got a bit bigger then. But like I said, it's been here for many years. I need to store some stuff here, my buddy. So, um, yeah, I'll be alright. I'll put some more clamps on. I've got to work out how many clamps I got. I will clean this up. I'll do that tomorrow. Well, that's alright. And all our edge now goes back through there, that'd be strong. But I will continue with these panels down there. I'll extend them on now and I'll keep going down there with them in. So when the edge comes through, I'll be really, uh, well, a lot more secure than just an edge. So that's what I've done, I just cut them back. Do so earlier. Clear this last bit away, chuck it over there. And uh, that's right. So that's done for the day. Alright, so please like and subscribe, thanks for watching, cheers.